things are wrapped up, the games come to a close, and that we're just all able to move on. A family torn apart in a car crash last year has finally gotten the admission they've been waiting to hear. Suspended Edgewood police officer James Fouch pleaded guilty in the crash that killed 23-year-old Jesse Sperry and critically injured his then pregnant wife. Rebecca Sperry gave birth to that daughter the day of the crash. And police say that Fouch had used prescription drugs that day too. Eyewitness News and reporter Naomi Peskovitz spoke with Rebecca and her young daughter about what today means and what's next. Until this hearing, Rebecca Sperry thought she'd have to sit through weeks of testimony and deliberations during a criminal trial. Now that's all behind them, though they do have to return to court one more time. Always composed and often laughing. <laughs> you can't see what the last 16 months have done to Rebecca Sperry and her little girl Autumn. You can describe a person, but it's not the same. He'll always be a stranger to her to a certain degree. In a hearing Thursday, suspended Edgewood police officer James Fouch entered a guilty plea to charges including reckless homicide. You know, it's, it's good to begin to close that chapter. Though Fouch did not speak directly to Rebecca and the family at the hearing, they could feel his remorse. Uh, he was like struggling not to cry. And you could tell it wasn't just because he was going to prison like that. The night of the crash, Rebecca held her husband Jesse in her arms as he died. She also remembers what James Fouch said to her moments after the crash. Well, Daddy was sorry. He was sorry from the time it happened. He said that at the scene. Mm. James Fouch faces two to 11 years in prison. The time frame irrelevant to Rebecca and little Autumn. When you've seen God work miracles like this, one after another, every single day, there is no room for anger. There is no room for giving the devil a foothold. Next month, the family and that suspended officer will return to this courthouse for sentencing. Rebecca is not quite sure exactly what she'll say to James Fouch that day, but she does know she'll say something about her faith. In Anderson, Naomi Paskovitz, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.